We are at the Box Hop in Rockbridge, Ohio, and this place is amazing. So let's take a tour. So when you first get here, you follow this gravel pathway leading up to this massive structure that is three shipping containers put together to make one incredible stay. So let me show you all the cool parts inside. Come on. So when you first walk inside, you realize how massive this space and area feels even though you're inside shipping containers. So when you walk into this foyer area, you've got a bench, coat racks, and just really open space inviting you in. We're gonna swing right off the entrance into the first of three bedrooms. So this is the first downstairs bedroom. Lots of window to bring in lots of light. And then right off of this bedroom, it connects to the bathroom, which is next door. So this is the downstairs bathroom, kind of the common bathroom for the downstairs area. You've got this massive tub and then a cute little vanity, plenty of towels, beautifully decorated modern downstairs bathroom. And then moving into the main area, you've got your living space and dining space right next to each other. Since this place does have three bedrooms, you can have a lot of people here with you so you can entertain, sit and hang out. They've got TV for entertainment and it's just an awesome open space. And it leads right into the kitchen that has plenty of cooking room and probably the most amenities we have seen in an Airbnb. They've got microwave, stove, a hidden dishwasher, which is amazing, French press, coffee they also have their own box hop brew and then this massive industrial sink that is beautiful and then look at this color it is an orange fridge I don't think I have ever seen an orange fridge in my entire <laughs> life so mega appliances are always really cool really retro but an orange one is a really nice touch <laughs> so you've got not only a stove top but an oven as well as a hood so if you cook anything you are set to go and they are so sweet because oh I I just flicked it on with my hip. And then they have a bunch of goodies like hot chocolate, popcorn, and to top off the amenities, they actually have a washer and dryer over here. They've got extra towels and toiletries. So if you forget anything, you can check in here. Basically, they hook you up. They also have some games for you in the laundry room. They have some books over here. So you have entertainment. This can be a staycation, but there are two more bedrooms upstairs and they are really cool. So let's go. And you get to go up a spiral staircase. Ooh. I mean, how cool is this? First thing you notice when you get off the stairs is this huge garage door that opens up into the lounge area outside on the top of the shipping containers below. And look at this beautiful blue velvet chair that you can sit in and enjoy the view because they are surrounded in woods and it is gorgeous. Coming into the second bedroom, you have this massive window that almost covers the entire side of this shipping container, looking out into an incredible view of trees and nature. Plus, they've got cute blankets, pillows, decorations to make this place just so modern yet cozy. And then, coming back this way, They've got the upstairs bathroom. It has beautiful tile finishes both on the floor and the walls of the shower and another cute vanity, towels, all that good stuff. And then probably the coolest room to me is this one that's glowing because they have a neon squiggle. That is so cool. That's and pretty cool. I think it's like kind of rubbery and so they put it in a really cool, neat shape and call it a day. So this room has little fuzzy touches, neon lights, just another unique room. So 
Now that we've shown you the inside, we will show you all of the amenities outside because there are quite a few and they are really cool. The first thing we'll show you is this deck up here. Boom, baby. So nice seating, hangout, lounge area outside on top of the first level of shipping containers and it's really cool. It's pretty neat. So if you follow me this way, we actually have another spiral staircase outside to take you back down to the first floor and the amenities that are outside down there. Right when you come off the spiral staircase outside, you have this massive grill. You can cook delicious meals. And then they have a hot tub. And it's, it's a big one. Huge. It's a big hot tub. It's massive. <laughs> Back out this way, they have this overhang that is created by the shipping container on top. So I'm wet, I'm dry. I'm wet, <laughs> I'm dry. Right here is the biggest, coolest, loungiest seating area they have outside. It's got a propane fireplace and lots of choices for seating. We are not done yet. There nope. is one more thing. I think one more thing. Two more things that are really cool around this place. So come on. Back out the front, you have a little stone pathway leading you over here. And for the true outdoorsmen, there is a crew fire pit and more outside chairs. And then, ooh, is that an outside? Oh my gosh! Oh, is it? We didn't even know. Okay, before we get to that, we'll get to this. <laughs> so this is an outdoor shower. We just found it. Surprises <laughs> around every corner, so make sure you explore this place. And then the actual last thing, my favorite, this swinging chair cocoon, cocoon capsule <laughs> thing. <laughs> This is so cool, and you can fit two people on here comfortably. Hayden, yes. want to come? Yeah, this is nice. <laughs> this place is so unique. The way that they've stacked these containers together, giving it that modern, slick feel, it really is a perfect aesthetic. And all the amenities, especially outside, there's just so much to do yeah. in this one little place. Mm -hmm. And we can't wait to hang out with our friends yes. here tonight. I know. <laughs> and now we are gonna hang out with our friends, Ben, Kaylee, and Alex, who we brought here. And we are gonna make the most of our time at the box hop. <laughs> And now we're gonna play a little game. We are now headed to one of the most popular spots in Ohio, Hawking Hills State Park, only about 20 minutes away from the box hop. Box Hop is an incredible experience. And unfortunately, we didn't get to actually meet our hosts, Emily and Seth, but they actually have their own YouTube channel where they film their builds of these amazing container homes. And one of their videos is actually their story. So if you wanna hear more from them and how the Box Hop came to be, we will link their channel in the description below. We would highly recommend following them along on their journey too. <sighs> 
So we're actually gonna do something a little bit special with this video because we did bring friends along with us. We saw Kara and Nate do this with a video. They had this time of confessions where you could just get away from everybody and just talk about how the trip has been. I'm gonna go first and I have to say that this has been better than what I expected. With Nikki and I filming and trying to put this together, there's a lot of moving pieces that you don't really understand unless you're here. Here. They've been so supportive and encouraging throughout the trip. And I'm just glad that we decided to bring them along because it made this day extra special. My favorite part of the trip itself was last night. Kaylee brought up some intentional questions that we could ask each other. And it just sparked just really deep, intimate conversation between us all. I love that we were able to come on this trip with our already close friends and then get even closer and just build memories together. You don't really think that you can go deeper, but then you have those opportunities like this in a place like this. And I think that's what's so special about the box hop. The way that it is set up, the big, huge wooden table was just a perfect meeting place to hold all of us. And I just love that we are able to make meals together. We are able to sit together and talk. Play games and it just really makes you feel like you can be close with everyone. The best part was uh, spending time in the hot tub last night, just reminiscing, bringing up those old memories. Just adds to the fun. These trips just create inside jokes and inside moments that are special. It truly has been such a sweet, good experience. Those are my thoughts and confessions. Anyway, I guess that's it. Um, I guess I should get out of here. Now it is time to leave. Our time here at the Box Hop has been nothing short of amazing. This place that Emily and Seth have created is absolutely awesome. If you want to book it yourself, we'll leave a link in the description below. That way you can. Great place to bring your friends. Totally. We love it. Totally. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel so you don't miss out on Airbnbs coming out every week and our new van life content. So stick around for that. But for now, come journey more with us. And, and we'll, we'll see you next, next time. Did you shoot? I did. Sorry. What are these little guys? <laughs> what so, are those little guys? Nikki, this is the shot you want. <laughs> <laughs> is it 1 a.m.? Yeah, no, it's 1 a.m. It's time to hop in the hot tub. All right, is this thing on? I think it is. Am I mic'd up? I don't have a mic. What was my favorite thing about the hangout? Uh, I feel like this question is designed for me to say hanging out with Hayden and Nikki. Uh, I guess that's true. <laughs> and just getting to do it with my wife. And she's amazing and hot and everything and more that I could have asked for. <laughs> she's going to watch this back. It's going to be hilarious. But anyway.